Hey, it's Michelle, and today I'll be doing this fun makeup transformation for you. I chose to do this look for that movie look because I was inspired by all the artificial intelligence films out there, and I wanted to do a look that made me look super flawless. Today I'm going to use the MAC Pro Longwear Nourishing Waterproof Foundation. This is actually a pretty new foundation from MAC Cosmetics, and I am completely obsessed with this product. I love it. Uh, this is definitely one of my favorite foundation. It is just absolutely flawless, and I'm just going to take a blending sponge and apply it all over my face now before I complete my face I like to just move on to the eyes and just to prevent the glitter from falling out and messing up the whole like foundation and everything now as you can see I already have one eye completed and the base that I'm using is actually the MAC Pro Long concealer and it gives my eyeshadow something to stick to and it makes my eyeshadow look really really pigmented and I love using it so next I'm going to grab my MAC 224 blending brush and in my crease I'm going to apply the eyeshadow saddle. It's just a nice light brown. It's just going to act as a transition color and it's going to look really really great when we add the other colors and it's just going to make it really easy for us to blend the eyeshadows together. Next I'll be using the MAC Purple Times 9 eyeshadow palette and I'm going to grab this like dark purple shade and I'm just going to pop that into the crease as well. Okay you guys so I'm like glitter obsessed. I'm going to go ahead and apply MAC's Reflex Transparent Pink Glitter. It's so so pretty and I'm just gonna pat that onto the lid now before I go any further with this eyeshadow look I have to fill in my brows so I'm gonna go right ahead and fill in my brows with a brow pencil this one is spiked by MAC once the brows are completed I'm gonna go ahead and create a wing liner on my top lash line so I like to use a gel liner and an angle brush to do so and if you ever have problems uh, creating a wing liner just take your time practice makes perfect and as you can see I still have the tape at the outer corner of my eye this is actually gonna help me to create a more like perfect wing liner <laughs> Now to create a more defined crease, I'm going to go into the eyeshadow Shadowy Lady by MAC and I'm just going to pop that into the crease using the MAC 217 brush. On the highest point of my brow bone, just to give it a nice highlight, I'm going to use MAC's Lemon Tart eyeshadow. Moving on to mascara, so you want to add some volume to the lashes. As you guys can see, I have some teeny tiny lashes so I definitely have to apply some mascara. Now I'm just going to go back over my liner because as you can see I have a bit of uh, glitter fallout on the liner so I'm just going to go back and reapply my liner. I'm also going to create a liner along the bottom lash line. This will kind of change the shape of my eyes, open them up a bit. Next I'll be adding this light purple Satellite Dreams by MAC also along the bottom lash line as well. Then we're going to move on to applying some mascara and I'm going to apply mascara to the bottom lashes. Now once the eyes are completed, I'm going to go ahead and do some contouring. This is just going to create some definition and dimension to the face. I absolutely love contouring. And I'm going to use the Bobbi Brown Foundation Stick. It's a few shades darker than my skin tone. Now what I'm going to do is apply in the hollows of my cheek, along my forehead area, down the sides of my nose, slim down the nose a bit. And this is actually going to slim down my face as well. And then I'm going to grab the MAC Dual Fiber Brush and just uh, blend out the, um, the product because we're not going to leave it like that. We have to blend that stuff out. To blend out the contour, I love using a uh, MAC Fix Plus spray so I like to wet my brush with it and what this does is just really help me to blend out the product really easy. Now we're going to go ahead and do some highlighting and I'm going to take a concealer that is a few shades lighter than my skin tone and I'm just going to apply it under my eyes, down my nose, along my forehead area and on my chin and above my cupid's bow and this is just highlighting so I'm just going to apply that and then I'm just going to blend that out with the sponge. Next I'll be going in with some powder just to set my makeup. To warm up my skin and create a stronger contour, I'm going to use Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess Bronzer. I love, love, love this bronzer. Okay, so we're almost finished with this look, so I'm going to go ahead and add some blush to the cheek. So I'm using Peaches by MAC, and I'm just going to apply that on the apples of my cheek. Okay, so I love to glow, so once I apply the blush to my cheek, I'm going to go ahead and apply some shimmer highlight. I love, love, love shimmer highlights, and these two are some of my favorites. So I'm going to use the MAC Gold Deposit, and I'm also going to use the Bobbi Brown Bronze Glow. And I'm just going to add this to the highest point of my cheekbone. This is going to make my skin look really nice and glowy. <laughs> Okay, so this look is definitely not completed until we apply the lipstick and stick into the whole theme of this look because we're doing a lot of pink here. I'm going to go for some pink lips as well, a light pink lip, but uh, I can't wear pink on its own, so I definitely have to line my lips first, and I'm using a brown lip pencil. This one is Cork by MAC, so I'm just going to line the lips, and then I'm going to grab the Lipstick Saint Germain by MAC and apply that on the lips as well. And just to finish off the lips and add a bit of gloss to it, make them look nice and shiny, we're going to add a little lip gloss so we're gonna use um, oyster girl by MAC 
the look is completed thank you guys so much for watching i had so much fun creating this look for you please give this video a thumbs up if you like and also make sure you subscribe to i love makeup look for more amazing videos bye